What's going on, YouTube? This your boy here, the truck and base head, coming to you live from Memphis, Tennessee today. Um, yesterday I posted a video, which was my very first YouTube video on yesterday, and it was asking the question about um, how many drivers like to deliver beer. Well, today's video is basically introducing myself and who I am and um, where I'm from and what I do and um, basically just talking, you know, to my future subscribers and viewers and um, basically just telling you a little bit about me. Well, I drive for a small trucking company out of Greenville, Mississippi, um, a fleet about 15 trucks and um, basically we haul a lot of different things like um, seeds and different type of farm stuff like pesticides whatever that's dealing with farming you name it um, we haul miscellaneous goods like today I'm in Memphis picking up a load of scrap paper that'll get me back down south um, basically I'm starting YouTube because I've been inspired by a few people. Um, I like, you know, expressing myself and and being truthful and you know just being honest, you know. And maybe I may have information to help new drivers that want to get in it and you know start a career. Um, advice for old drivers because one thing about truck driving, you know, you you never learn enough. You're going to learn something new every day. And that's something I've learned in the 12 years I've been driving. Um, yeah, I'm from the Mississippi Delta, Greenville, Mississippi. You know, the little big small place is what I call it. And um, I drive a truck. So today's vlog, I'm in Memphis, Tennessee at the scrap paper yard picking up some papers about five or six trucks ahead of me but I ain't really tripping about it because I'm going to load this and then go home um, I'm at home basically every day pretty much um, I'm off on the weekends pretty decent company you know but I love driving trucks and also I am a base head yeah I'm a base head I, I've been loving base since I was about 12 years old and um, I install systems I do it do it all pretty much so that's why my channel is called the truck and base head because on this channel you'll be getting content from um, car audio trucking you know just basically vlogging my life you know and showing the enjoyment that I get out of life <laughs> you know and um I know I'm sounding a little bit nervous because I'm sitting here talking to the camera but you know, I think I'm going to enjoy doing this. So, um, any questions, comments, concerns, you know, just feel free to ask. Um, I'm an open person. I keep it honest. I keep it truthful because that's what we need in this industry, you know. There's no need of lying to anybody or telling them a lie. It's best to be honest because honesty is, go honesty is going to take you a long way. And that's one of my policies of life. That's what I was taught. You know, that being honest will take you a long way. I've drove for quite a few companies. You know, um, some things were my fault. Some things were their fault. You know, some jobs didn't work out. Some worked out perfect. You know, um, I've done lease purchase. I have information on lease purchase for those guys that like to lease. Um, company driving. You name it, you know, whatever I can tell you to help you, you know, I'll do that most most definitely. Um show you guys where I'm at if I if I could flip it around here. I'm using the uh, Samsung Galaxy S8 to record my videos for now. Let's see. spin it around but well, I can't spin it around right now but um yeah looks like we're about to get a little rain today I don't know uh 
the truck that I drive is a 2006 Freightliner Century Class with the 475 Cat in it. Um, I love it. It's a 13 speed that's been converted to a 9 speed, so um, you don't have to split the gears on the high side. You just shift all the way up, and then when you get to ninth gear, um, it shifts on its own. Um, I'm familiar with 13 speed, 18 speed, 21 speed, Super 10. I drove all of those trucks. Um, so it's cool. It's cool. Sorry about that. Had a phone call. That was dispatch calling me, letting me know that they had changed my release number. So I had to make a few phone calls to get that situated. But, um, yeah, a couple of people that I've watched on YouTube, I've watched uh, the Scooby-Doo show. Pretty cool guy. I watched this show. I've watched uh, Trucker Brown. He's pretty cool. Uh, Be Smooth. Be Smooth, he's pretty cool, too. I've watched his channel. Um, those guys have had some interesting um, stories to tell and information to give, you know. And um, I'm trying to think of who else channel that i uh, chasing andrew jackson i've watched his channel um he out there in that oil field getting that money i like that too um one more person that i've watched a lot uh can't think of him but uh golden child that's his name golden child shouts out to golden child too because he have a lot of knowledge too on trucking um I'm subscribed to all those guys' channels, and I like their content, you know, so that's one thing also that made me want to add my, you know, 12 years into it to get on here and, you know, just talk to drivers and talk to other people, but basically, um, the trucking community is pretty strong on YouTube, and I like that. Um, as far as the base head side, Steve Mead, uh, Jonathan Price, actually, um, I've met Jonathan Price in person in Greenville. Um, that's that's he's we're from the same place. Um, I met him one night and got a demo from the the Tahoe, and it sounded really good in person. And uh, quite a few guys I watch um, in the base head community. So yeah, I like I like the base too. Yeah, so you know that's that's why my channel is called the truck and base head just to give you guys an idea of who I am and what I like to do and what type of content that I will be showing and what type of content that I will be making. Um, also, shout out to Eliminate. Um, Randy, those guys out in California, they've been, you know, they, they're car guys. They've been very in influencing to me, very influencing to me um, as far as starting a YouTube channel. And just basically the YouTube community all together, those are the few people that I can think of off the top of my head that has given me motivation to want to do a YouTube page. So, um, I will be coming up with more content, but I just thought that today I would let you guys know who I am and what I do. And um, hopefully in the future, the videos be great, the content be great, the followers get strong. Um, also, shout out to EXO, too. I watch his channel. I'm subscribed to him, too. He's a pretty cool guy. I like him, too. Uh, pretty down-to-earth guy as far as YouTube. So, yeah, you know, just to shout out a few people that I know on YouTube that I watch a lot. And um, I enjoy their videos, too. So, this YouTube thing is new to me. Um, it's growing on me, and, and hopefully I'll be successful at it. You know, that's... That's the plan. That's the plan. Yep. So, um, pretty much to look at in the truck, I'm quite sure that everybody's seen what a Century Class look like in the inside. I mean, it's nothing perfect. It's, it's nothing special. You know. So, yeah, that's the sleeper. That's the sleeper. That's the bed. I actually started out with KLLM um, back in 2007 and the first truck I ever drove was a Columbia 
and then I work for Total Transportation of Mississippi. I work for them. Um, I drove the Cascadia's there, the Peterbilt 386, the small nose Peterbilt's. Um, and I drove at least the Volvo 780. I love that truck. It's a comfortable truck. One of the best riding trucks in the world to me is a Volvo 780. I drove a 379 Peterbilt. They drive pretty good too. I like the suspension on them, how they hood curves. Um, I've done reefer, I've done dry van, I've done little low boy, hopper bottom. We do that real big over here too. We do um, a lot of a lot of hopper bottom work, um, hauling out of the fields and hauling grain, rice, and all that good stuff. So it'll be a lot of content of that coming too. Um, maybe when I get back, if it isn't too late, I'll finish up the video at the yard to give you all an idea of what our yard look like and you know all that good stuff. So once I get this video edited and get it up, hopefully it gets some views, you know, some likes, some comments and everything you know feel free to comment you know and like share all that good stuff so until then